Last time we looked at the reasons why Germans rarely talk about money, which currencies there are and have been, and the general comparison of price levels and average income. Today we are going into more detail and taking a look at individual occupational groups and comparing them. In a 2017 study, research was carried out into what people earn at the end of the fictitious working life at the age of 64. If you leave aside the cost of living, we can see that in Switzerland and Austria the results look equally good after both an apprenticeship and a degree. And for female employees in Switzerland it's even better after an apprenticeship than after a degree. This is in stark contrast to Ireland, the USA or Chile, where you earn considerably more money with a degree than in an apprenticeship. In Germany, women seem to end up with more money with a vocational qualification than with a degree, whereas men end up with more money with a degree. The difference here is far greater than in Austria or Switzerland, but far less than in USA or Chile. This is all very simplified and there are numerous factors that influence this. So let's take a look at different occupational groups. If you look at education spending around the world, we see quite high spending in Europe, considering the number of citizens in each country. Teachers in Germany are very well paid compared to other teachers in the OECD and also compared to similarly educated workers. In Flemish Belgium and New Zealand, the pay of teachers is pretty much at the same level as other workers with the same level of education. When a teacher is hired, a teacher at primary, secondary and intermediate schools, Haupt and Realschule in North Rhine-Westphalia, starts at pay grade 11. That would be in 2022 3,652,64 cents. If we look at the salaries of civil servant teachers in North Rhine-Westphalia, teachers at primary, secondary and intermediate schools are paid A12. Teachers with special educations are paid A13 and teachers at grammar schools, the comprehensive schools or vocational colleges are paid A13 with a supplement. Head teachers are paid A14 to A16 depending on the type of school. If you look at a salary table, a civil servant teacher starts at €3,931.13 and after a few years receives €4,292.61, while the starting salary for a head teacher at A15 is €5,628.53. Other civil servants are also paid according to this list, or the table for federal civil servants here. A12, what is the starting salary of a teacher, is comparable to that of a captain in German armed forces, a company commander or an experienced police chief inspector in police forces. A16, the highest paid head teachers, would be comparable to the salary of a colonel in the army or a senior police director. Salaries can of course vary at private schools. Speaking of soldiers, if we look at salaries in a European comparison, German officers are well paid, but non-commissioned officers and enlisted men are also well paid in comparison. And if we look at the average salaries of police officers, the salary in German is also in the upper average. Let's take the three salaries of new teachers, new police commissioners and new soldiers at the lowest rank and the statutory minimum wage as references. I always try to find the starting salaries. Of course, income increases over the years, but with different levels of experience and all kinds of further training and education, further salaries would be far too difficult. So let's stick with a salary after completing an apprenticeship or with a bachelor degree. Let's assume full-time. What is 4.33 weeks per month at 40 hours, what is 172 hours per month. With a minimum wage of 12 euro 41 per hour, you can earn 2134 euro 52. 
A trained hairdresser in the first year as a journeyman receives 13 hours per hour or 2236 euro per month. A few euros in tips can make a big difference. According to the DGB, the German Trade Union Confederation, the minimum wage for temporary workers is 13 euro 50. This does not necessarily require an apprenticeship to earn 2000 322 euros per month. For scaffolders, the minimum wage is 13 euro 60 or 2339 euro 20. Once trained and with two years of experience, a scaffolder would earn 17 euro 91 per hour or 3080 euro 52 per month. Amazon, Aldi or Lidl offer an entry wage of 14 euro per hour or 2408 euro per month for unskilled workers. Journeyman bakers earn at least 14 euro 30 per hour, skilled painters and varnishers 15 euro and journeyman roofers 15 euro 60 or 2683 euro 20 per month. In this video I talked about the first strike by medical assistants. They now get 2,700 euro a month, but for 167 hours full time. What is five hours a month less than the tradespeople before? 2,706 euro 99. It was a new temporary soldier gets. However, at the weekly working time here is 41 hours. That would be 176 hours point three per month, at least if there are no exercises that takes longer. In the metal industry, you start after three years of training in pay group 4 and at 2810 euro with a 35 hour week or 150 and a half hour per month. A nursing specialist receives 3139 euro after successful completing school based training. A person with a bachelor degree who works in training and further education receives at least 3,293 euro 80. An educator with state recognition, what is after school training and one year of recognition, starts in the SHA grouping and at 3,303 euro 85 per month. Our police commissioner in the Federal Police Force gets 3,350 €4.26. With a bachelor degree you would be grouped in pay grade 7 in the metal industry and start at 3,502 €. Apprenticeships or degree courses in these professions generally last three years. A teaching training course usually lasts four and a half years. An employed teacher would be placed in pay group 11 and receives 3508 euro 11 per month. An assistant doctor has studied for at least six years. According to the pay scale of municipal clinics, this starts at 4852 euros per month. It is possible that extra pay for shift or night work, especially in the metal industry, the police or hospitals, can add even more money. The important thing in all of this is that you like the job and can imagine doing it for the rest of your life. It is no longer the case that you have to stay in one company your whole life and you can of course change jobs. but training as a bricklayer is of little use if you want to work in care for elderly and training as a businessman is of no use if you would rather cover roofs. So even before the money you should like the work, whether it's cooking or baking, building or programming or whether you'd rather deal with human or commercial problems. Many Germans have a hobby to balance things out like sports if you spend a lot of time in the office or model making or fishing if you are always around people. It's about a balanced life. These salaries were gross. This is stated in the employment contract. What is transferred to the account at the end is a net salary. There are some sites with net wage calculators where you can see for yourself 
what is left over net. Income tax and social insurance contributions, including health insurance and pension insurance, are deducted directly from your salary by your employer and transferred to the tax office or social insurance provider. The tax bracket depends on whether you are married or not and receive child allowances according to the number of children. Church tax only applies to certain religion communities, typically the two major Christian churches. Our nurse would receive a net wage of 2,129,73 Euro as a single person without children and not subject to church tax. At minimum wage, 2,134,52 Euro gross would leave 1,551,47 Euro. The money is also regularly transferred to the current account in Germany. It is therefore expected that the employee has a current account. At the beginning of May we will take a look at the banking system of Germany. As we said in the last video about money, the costs of living in Germany is of course quite high and whether the income is enough to live on depends on the location and living conditions. Living in the center of big cities like Munich, Frankfurt or Berlin is considerably more expensive due to rent than in small towns like Miltenberg, Höxter or Schwerin. The cost of food on the other hand is usually quite the same. If you would like a detailed calculation of what for example a single person in Germany or the USA or a family of four would earn and what is left over at the end, I can recommend the videos by Type Ashton. If anyone knows of similar videos with comparisons between Germany and other countries, please feel free to mention them in the comments. Let's see if we can come up with a good list. Thank you for your attention and see you at the next video.